Hey folks, it's Chuck and Quills, and welcome back to more Paint the Town Red for your viewing enjoyment and my playing pleasure. Now today we have no specific theme for uh, for in mind. We have three randomly selected levels, and I'm gonna go ahead and just pretty much get started right into this first one. This one is Hotel <laughs> Hotel Vissoria 2 by Ragnar Lothbrok. I think I'm saying that right. And we did see number one. I remember very much enjoying number one. It was fantastic, had a lot of weapons. A lot of variety. It was just a general good blast to have. So we're going to start with this one. And well, let's read the short story we have and go with it. Hello, buddy. You again have to destroy the Mafia groupies. But one of the Mafia leaders survived. In the last meeting, he was able to escape. You will have to kill him. I wish you good luck. So with that being said, I think we can get right into this. Let's just see what we can do. Now we got the police just kind of stay, you know, chilling in here. That's fine. I like it when you guys chilling. I'm going to take your right shield if you don't mind. And I'm gonna go find a weapon. I like the design. I couldn't, I didn't even realize this was like a natural sky for his early little blocks. I read a tiny little box, but it looks fine. Is this a door I can get into? Y'all don't care if I just like get into your car, right? Y'all just have like stacks of money in here? That's disappointing. Um, interesting. Okay, so that's the Vasori Hotel. This is, are they making, I think they're making a home. Okay, I was gonna say, what the fuck? What are they? What are they doing? This is dangerous, don't y'all think? Making a freaking... I don't know what kind of people assemble a home like that, but Jesus, that is a frightening home to be in. Uh, what else do we have in here? The prisoners are all, of course, seeping in here. Security guards, stand by. Uh, we have a machete, which I guess I'll take and use to my fullest extent. I don't know how big this level is. It doesn't seem overly big. He's making a gun. Um, closet, bathroom, hello buddy. Uh, well, I don't know why you're jinking in here. What else we got going on? What's up here? Oh, I'm here to meet the Mr. Pimp Man. That's okay, I killed him. I had no choice. The Pimp. Was he the gang leader? Did I do my job right? I, I don't know. I feel like maybe he was the gang leader. I, I generally have no idea. There's a single bull in here. That didn't even kill him with it. That's fine, though. Oh, friend, you got in the way. That's not my fault. I did nothing wrong there. I'm innocent. Is this from Hotline Miami? Am I, am I going crazy? Is that not? Is this not Hotline Miami? I feel like I'm going crazy. Uh, oh, hi. No. Please die. Please, go away. Please, just cease your, cease bodily functions, I beg of you, sir. Where'd the baseball bat go? Here we go. It's fine, I'm making it work. I'm doing what I can. Just die for me. Just please, don't, don't approach me. Why are you all coming in here? I want to go see the rest of the world. They're coming in here to trap me. To keep me pinned inside of this, this bland home as I stab them all in the face with a freaking shiv. Why are these shivs so fucking effective? These are actually amazing weapons. What the fuck? What was this shiv? Why was why is this shiv made of like fucking adamantanium or whatever the fuck it's called? Is there anything in here? I don't know, I was just breaking glasses. I didn't really know if there was. Okay, I'm good. What else is going on in this map? I, I know there's a lot more buildings I haven't checked out, so I'm gonna check them out first. I think everyone who was in here probably came over to fight me. Um, which sucks for them, but not for me. It sucks for them because they're dead. I, I should have I should have said that. Uh, I have a gun and a few extra guns. I'm just gonna shoot you for coming at me. Uh, let me go grab a shotgun. This has no ammo in it. And I'll just take the rifle, I guess. Hey buddy, go away. And goodbye. What else do I want? The shivs? Shivs are just too effective. I mean, like, this is probably... The shiv is, strangely enough, probably one of the best weapons in the game, and I don't know why. It's just really good at what it does. And so, like, I just... You can never get mad. Why are you guys on the ground? I, no, that's, that's weird. Hello, gentlemen. Um, yes, yeah, so it just one-shots the big guys. It's insane. Big guy. The big guys never stood a chance. Sir, you're missing about half your fire. I don't even know what the hell happened to you. But you know what? It's fine. Um, you need to not approach me. I will literally just keep bashing your skulls in. Your ever-increasing uh, brain power will just be... <laughs> what am I even saying? I don't even know. I'm trying to think of something to say. I'm trying to become I'm trying to intimidate NPCs to no avail. I don't know what I just saw in there. Hello, friends. What's going on here? Are... Have you, were you all busy killing someone? You're all kind of just standing in here like the job's been done. I... I have the feeling that... Uh, they're just kind of vibing there. I'm gonna take these two. Okay, another shift. Well, shift central over here. Hello, friends. And, and uh, oh, you guys are. Listen, I'm just gonna long live the king. Can I get a two for one. Can you fall off, please? 
along with the goddamn king. I'm just too good at what I do. Okay. Now to actually go into the hotel itself. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. What the fuck am I seeing? Sir, please, your body. It's violating all of the realms of physics. It, it doesn't make any sense. It's, it's, that body needs to be stopped. I have to stop that body. I don't know what's going on with it. It's scaring me. How can I one-shot a fucking big guy with a freaking shiv, but not one-shot him with my fists? I am baffled. I am I am perplexed, stunned, uh, freaking uh, 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 jaw dropped. I don't even know if that's a real way to describe like something. Hello, oh fucking sous chef, you little bitch, you little fucking sneaking up on me with a fucking tray, you little little jerk, you little fucker. Uh, no, that's not a shiv. I thought that would have been a shiv. I hear people moving. Oh, that's because they're all coming to kill me. Um, hello. Ow. You see, I'm fine. That, that, this is a little, little tickle. A little hurt. It hurt a little bit. Not too much. Listen, I just need you all to die. I need you to go away. Perish. Cease. Your existence. I have two friendlies. A bunch of chefs over here currently just fighting over whatever the fucking... I guess maybe this had some disagreements about the... About the dishes they were serving. I don't know. I'm, I'm just here to put an end to the fight. I was just here to kill the, the mob boss. Listen, can you just... Do me a favor and literally die. I have had to hit off your hand. Jesus. Alright, that's it. That's it. Alright, you're getting the nice hand of the face. Who are you? Go away. I don't want you next to me. As for you, chefs, I don't fuck with you. I don't fuck with you. Can you? How dare you? How fucking dare you? Who's alive? You're alive. I think I've done it. I think I've done it. And there's no one left. I've done my job. There's only the two allies. And you, Please, sir. His body's gonna consume this world. There's nothing more. I must leave. Oh, hello, friends. We must go. But yeah, a fantastic little level. Great job once again. Kind of took me a while to get to this one. I definitely saw it a while ago, but never really got around to playing. I just wasn't sure what to fit it in with, but I'm glad I did. So yeah, link will be in the description as always for these levels, folks. But we still have two more levels for this video. And as always, I'll see you folks in the next level. All right, folks, welcome back to, I guess, the next level. I'm loading it in. Or I'm resuming doing it. You're going to see this. That's why. A nice little intro to the level. But yeah, this is the second level of the video. This is Fluffles at the Border by TNT Fox. And well, if there's anything I know about these Fluffles levels, they tend to be a little, um, little interesting in one way or another. So let's just go ahead and see what we can get. Um, SCP Ethics Department. <laughs> fucking just a... Just a fucking skeleton. Okay. But is the F isn't the ethics committee like one of the most like feared or like powerful committees in the entire SCP Foundation? These are this is that's chaos insurgency. Wait, why is chaos insurgency and MTF both just chilling? That's a fucking nine-tailed fox. NTF. Oh, I don't remember that symbol. No, you are see that's see it. Wait, what are you? I don't remember that. Um, I don't know if that's is that serpent's hand. No. I have no idea what that is. I can't tell what that symbol is. You guys, more chaos insurgency with a D class. What is this? What is this level? I don't understand what's going on here. Can I? Is there a card back here? I'm looking for a blue card by any chance. I get the feeling I gotta kill some people here. All right. The only way I'm gonna get out of here is if I start murdering a bunch of. Okay. What the fuck? Why are they like professional boxers? What is this? Why he's a pretty he's literally okay. I didn't see the big hands of that man. Mm -mm -mm. Disappointing. In myself and in everything else there. Let me out of this fucking cage. I'm let me out of this let me out of this fucking thing. Friend, we have to go. There's things I must learn. The ethics committee is is requiring me to, to cleanse this fucking facility. And the only way to do that is to grab the nearest machete I see and find the man with the biggest hands and teach him a lesson. Or I literally don't even know what I did. I don't think I did anything. I don't- yeah, no, I have chairs though. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. You literally- wh why? Alright, I have so many chairs you can't possibly kill me. I am literally God. I am the God of chairs. The God of all wooden structures meant to be sat upon. Stools, chairs, it doesn't matter. Stumps. I will throw a fucking stump at your head if I could. Beautiful, he's finally dead. You two over there, you're lucky I only have two more chairs. Wait, hold on, walk, walk into it? Beautiful. Fucking beautiful. I work just like a plant. Just as planned. Give me the fucking chair. Don't ever touch my chair again. My chairs are all gone. I have nothing else to throw. Wait, there's one more. There's one fucking... Okay, now it's actually gone. Alright, well, I have to use the knife now. I didn't want to. 
but I have no choice. Yeah, I love how I just walked next to the, um, oh, hello, friend. I need you to die. I need you to perish so that I might continue. You've done, you've done it now. You've done it now. You've done it. Where's the blue card? I, is it in the fridge? It's in the fridge, ain't it? Why would you not be in the fridge? It's not in the fridge. I lied to myself. Where is this blue card? I will find it and I will proceed. Is it in the microwave? I get the feeling it's in the microwave. Open up the dip. Open up the microwave. Come on. Come on, you can do it. It's not in the... Oh, it's right here. I'm... I'm smart at this game, I swear, folks. I'm good. I'm good at this game. Hello, friend. Orange man bad? No, orange man never bad. Orange man good. Orange man great. We are great, orange man. Listen, orange man, did you just fuck him? Did you just beat him with an orange? You are literally orange man. Orange man don't fuck around. He just out. He's out here in the SCP testing. The f oh my god! I was wondering what that was. Oh my god! Wait, please t hold on. Hold on. I need to see that. I need to go into that fucking cage. Actually, no, I don't trust it. Fucking Carl. I don't fucking trust it. I don't trust. Carl's gonna fucking take my hands. He's gonna fucking take my hands. I don't want to. I want my hands to be mine. I don't trust Carl with my hands. He's gonna. He's gonna kill me if I step in there. Have you guys managed to? Oh, you fucking obliterated her skull. E, there's a just a fucking. What was it? It's Carl and I can't remember the uh, fucking other one's name. Is it Paul? I always thought your name was Carl and Paul. Oh my god. That series ended in such a fucked up way, in such a way that, like, I just did not expect it. Okay, well, I'm not going into the fucking cage with the llamas. That is not something I'm doing. I don't trust the llamas with, with anything. Uh, hello, sir. I understand you're sleeping, but we don't sleep here. I'm glad you were sitting on that. That makes things a lot easier. Um, okay. Top secret SCP Foundation Site 69. All right, let's go see what's in these other rooms. We have some... some open up these doors. Oh. Oh, that's what's in. What the fuck? I don't know what this is. I don't know what I just walked into, but I'm not looking at that anymore. And what do we we have nukes? Well, now I just want to emergency on-site nuclear detonation authorized use only for site thirteen sixty nine four twenty. Um, isn't site thirteen like isn't site thirteen like the biggest site in the world? If I press this button, oh, I actually just blew, <laughs> oh my god, I actually just blew them up. Okay, well, we have confirmed detonation on sites 13 and 420. Site 13 was, I think, one of the biggest sites in all the SCP Foundation, or most important, I can't remember. Um, and they're just dead. I, I couldn't imagine why this um, facility would house the only nuclear option. What is even going on here? Hello, sirs. Um, I'm here looking for... The blood and soul. It's me. Hello. I haven't seen myself in a while. It's great to see my life. It's great to see me. It's always great. How could you not love to see me? Yeah, go fuck him up. Go fuck him up. I'm, I'm... <laughs> okay. It was great to see me until I guess Big Orange Man. I guess Big Orange Man is bad. He, <laughs> he wasn't having any of that. He literally just fucking said no fuck you and blew my head off with his fist. I want to be mad, but at the same time, I'm equally impressed at the fact that the AI somehow managed to do that. Oh my god, that's so weird. Okay, well. Uh, hottest honest bombs, tires, nails, and broken glass. Well, I guess he does have the tires in here. He's got broken glass. Or uh, I guess the nails are put away in the... <laughs> Hello. Oh my god, how do you even crash it? How does the car burn like that? It's a laundromat? What is this? We don't do laundromats, we do- Oh my god, there's just a road of broken glass. Oh, that's that's why he- Okay. Hello, bodyguard. I need you to die. What is- There's nothing even in here. Oh, what the fuck. I lied. Okay, well... Can my- Can my fucking big orange man friend come and knock one of your guys' head off? That would be great. Uh, hello, construction workers. I understand you're probably still busy. Um, do understand that this is currently just a change in leadership. Um, I have to get rid of you. Uh, the company is just, you know, I've got to hire some people for cheaper. And the company I saw, getting rid of you guys would be the best thing to do that. 
Um, moving on, there is a dead body down there. I thought that was someone. There's no one over there. And what is this? The Fluffles clan. What is what? Okay, I want to come back to that thing. What is hello? Why do you have a gun? Who is this man? What the fuck? Oh, what the fuck? No, 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 no. No, I refuse. Um, I have no idea what happened there. There's a safe back there. I'm not gonna look in it. I'll leave something for you folks to find out. But I want to run back into the facility and press the nuke button because at this point, I think I've definitely won. There is a Delorean here. What is that? I just I just press something. It's all the fluffles. What the fuck is wrong? What are you? You're so dirty. Okay, I have no idea what's going on in here. You are not a friendly. So let's get rid of you. We don't do non-friends here. Oh, hey, Cap, and like in the new. Okay, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna blow this fucking facility. I don't want to. I don't want. I don't want anything here to live. I feel like that's the only way to do this. Blowing up site uh, 69 is the only way for us to progress as the human race. Is the is the next step into life and somehow I, I i don't know we we've come this far this this race is a doomed race we are best off just like handing the reins to like ants or something i mean they got things going they they know what to do we just need to wait for ants to evolve into like the next intelligent species and just freaking go from there i okay yeah yeah let's just let's just get rid of this site this facility uh fucking i'm gonna run i i did press that button i don't know if i just did something have I killed us? Is there death coming? That didn't do anything. Wait, what? Did I just get pranked? Did I just get pranked? Did this game just pr Are we not in Site 69? Have I been lied to? Have I been bamboozled? We are in Site 69. At least I thought we were. Based off the sign outside, unless I read it wrong, we should be dead. So why are we... Why are we not dead? Have I been... I've been lied to. My heart is broken. Never to recover. Unfortunate. Yeah, wasn't there a sign? I swore there was a sign. Oh no, it was in here. That's right. It was on the wall. It was... Yeah, Tom, we should have been dead. I guess we... The nukes, those were just dud nukes. I was bamboozled. Well, that's unfortunate because I really wanted the world to die. Maybe it killed all the friends. I don't know if my if my friends are still alive. No, they're still alive down there. Yeah, this never happened. The nuke was a lie. It was a nice little thing. If it, if I had died, I think that would have been the best thing. But now I gotta actually head to Site 13 and uh, just launch the worldwide nukes. I gotta do it that way. Um, no survivors. No survivors. I'm cleaning up this mess. Captain, I hope you understand, but this is for the best. Big Orange Man, you killed me. Holy shit. Big Orange Man. Please. Oh. Big Orange Man. Big Orange Man. What the... F what the fuck are you... Jesus. Big Orange Man. He was terrifying. There's still one more missing, but you know what? I'm not gonna... I'm just gonna leave. A fantastic level TNT Fox. Weird as always, but... I mean, that's just what you do, and it's a good weird. It's it's the kind of weird, it's like, what the fuck is happening? But I'm having fun with the, what the fuck is happening. So, um, yeah, with that being said, we still have one more level for the video, folks. And I'll see you folks in that last level. All right, folks, welcome to the last level of the video. This is On the Train by Mr. Yorecto and Armando Casas. So, we're going to go ahead and just get started. There is no story. And I'm starting off with some chairs here, some wonderful stools. I'm pretty sure this is actually a fairly... Okay, well, I did not actually mean to hit someone there. I just want to double check. How old is this level? It's made in 2017. This level is almost almost four years old. That was made in April. So it's definitely over three, almost four. That's crazy to think that levels out here, I've been, I'm playing levels from four years ago, and yet they're still fantastic to this day. Like, they just, they run, they work. Um, I say that as I'm getting just completely slaughtered. I don't like the chair. I, this is just kind of something with the game itself. I hate having to get like prop locked. Um, I, I, nice little Gary's mod term, I guess, for dark RP servers. Getting prop locked by a fucking bunch of chairs and shit that just like somehow never makes sense. It's like I get launched by a a, a, a freaking chef's hat because I guess chef's hat now have the, the, their entities are more than I could ever considerably handle. Sir, please just die for me. Thank you. I just need to get through. Like, look at the, the tables are just making this almost impossible to traverse. 
I don't even know what to do at this point. Hello, can I get over this way? I just need you to die. I'm trying to get to the- oh, it's even worse in here. Okay, well, it's not going well. Listen, sir, I just need people to die. I need to progress to the next area. The only way I'm doing that is through the death of millions. I must kill the entire world. It is my duty. I- the- the ta Please get this freaking these tables out of the way. Sir, you look very nice today, but I have to kill you. What are you doing to this man? Cease. There is another glass here. Hold on. Leave that man alone. I must kill him. Only I may kill people. Hello, sir. I'm taking the hand of yours. Or you're just gonna die. That works too. I'm not gonna complain. But you all must die. There is no other way but death. Death is the only way forward. It is the only thing that can save humanity. Save our planet from ourselves. You need to... Sir? I'm not gonna ask again. Sir? Not gonna... Ask again, sir. Just give me your soul. Thank you. Alright, now we can move along. More chairs. Hold on. I can't- I don't even know if I can throw these. I can't even get to the door. I can't even get to the- Can you all just let me through? I just want to get through. You're not dead. You're not dead. I, you know, all these people in here just need to die. I'm gonna kill you, Mr. Biker Boss. I'm gonna kill your family. I'm gonna kill your loved ones, your best friend, your dog, your- Actually, not the dog and the cat. The dog and cat are fine. Oh my god, the- Oh, a freaking prison ship. Let's go. Uh, please just die. No, die. Don't, don't, don't get up and fight me. Thank you. Okay, we're doing good. We're doing good. Just gonna keep throwing shit at people. Is the only way for me to ever potentially, uh, hold on, just work, work with me here. Just, just work with me here. Just work with me here. I, I'm getting stuck on the, I think I saw a machete. There is a machete. I'll take it. Hello, you're the last nine people left on this train. I must kill you. There's nothing else for you to do here. Alright. Oh, hello, sir. Please go away. Sir? I'm asking you kindly. Does my- does my please have nothing- mean nothing to you? Who is alive here? Sir, I ask you to please die. To cease your bodily functions. So who is the train captain? Hello, captain. I need you to die. I need your bodily- I need your- I need you to just cease your- existence right now. That's all I want from you. I've taken your hand. I will actually just- okay, I got fucking sucked in a- that's what I'm talking about. A freaking captain hat just sent me on a merry-go-round. I don't know why that happens. It's very- it's very distressing. It can often- no, I guess we're done. But yeah, a fantastic three levels for today's video. I forgot to turn the music back up, which is now I realize why it's like so quiet. It's just me talking except for like the sound of hitting things. Um, but yeah, okay, fantastic levels. Link in the description for all of these. If you like what you saw, folks, and you want to see more in the future, you know what to do. This has been Jumping Quills, and I'll see you folks in the next one.